you ever done like just like a little rinse like I didn't actually shower shower I just kind of pre-shower shower gel wet the hair so it's easier to manage I did a little co-wash one two three didn't detangle it because we're not doing that can't forget about miss birth control I actually have chewable birth control I have an autoimmune disease so I take a lot of pills or I was taking a lot of pills I kind of simplified it all down to just a Humira shot if you're unaware I have sarcoidosis so I do have to take some pills I just haven't been taking them I hate taking pills which is kind of ironic because now I kind of need to for the rest of my life I told my gynecologist that I literally just want chewable birth control and she was like we have that I was like ah, you do sign me up tastes like mints if you're in the market for some birth control, you don't want to do the shot, you don't want to do IUD, because I've done it all, girl. If anyone's going to know, it's me, okay? This is probably the best form that I've taken so far for my body. Get you a chewable. I'm going to do my hair a little bit. Um, I am going to the gym, so it's going to be like kind of like a light gel situation. I'm kind of nervous to work out with this shirt on because I normally tend to work out with dark shirts on because I hate pit stains or just sweat stains in general like a year or two ago i went to um a gym with my friend and i was wearing a dark gray shirt but i was sweating so much this is like in the beginning when i wasn't really working out like that so i guess i was just sweating up a storm and my entire back was just bleh. the more fitness bloggers that i watch leanna d being basically the number one one i'm starting to get more comfortable with the fact that like yes i have sweat glands i'm gonna sweat but i really love this shirt I haven't gotten a chance to wear it i have another one with like the smiley face on it but i've worn that so many times i saw this one at h&m a couple of months ago and I was like yes I wish I could just leave my hair in a ponytail but it just never wants to work out like that so it's a bun and because I'm going to the gym I'm literally not even gonna do it again I'm just gonna leave it in whatever it just created for itself half of the time there's hair sticking out of the bottom because I think my hair is getting to that length where it's like stop putting me a bun stop putting me in a bun but I just don't feel like going through the struggle. Like people with curly hair, no. Like it's just too much. I'm gonna do my edges with this Baby Shark toothbrush. But before I do that, I just realized I forgot to wash my face. The face wash I have right now is the mini version, but I love this one so much. I ran out of my big one, but once I run out of the mini, I gotta get the big one again because this really helps my skin. I'm on the hunt for like a really good moisturizer. And I saw yesterday that this girl I was watching on YouTube um uses ponds and my mom has been using ponds since like the dawn of time i don't even know why i didn't think to go to ponds earlier i was gonna buy like a really expensive moisturizer from sephora during the sale i missed the sale not because i wasn't aware but because i just never ended up following through with my impulses to go to the sephora sale so i think after the gym i'm gonna go to target I need to get um, iced coffee anyway, pre-made, because I'm tired of paying. And maybe a Pond's moisturizer. I think I also need to get something to clean my tub with, because I just moved and I forgot to bring my rags and my spray and my brush and all that for the tub floor. And I took about two baths in there, so I definitely need to clean my tub. My vet is calling me. <laughs> Hello. I was just calling to remind you of your appointment tomorrow at 1045. The person that I had talked to previously said they were going to refill Lucky's prescription. I personally called that in on Monday. Okay. Do you mind giving me the number of the um the place that you prescribed it to? Um, yeah, let me pull your record. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. I started putting Vaseline on my nose because I have like like a little dry skin on there. I feel like the girl from the Puffs commercial, like what is going on? And then this is a necessity. If you don't use men's deodorant, hop on it sis, okay? 10 times better. Do the chicken dance real quick. Haven't worn my sweet sweatband in forever. All right, this is the gym fit. Got the shirt, Gymshark leggings, Adidas. And you cannot forget your gym scent of the day. Pink's Mary Pink Mist. I definitely recommend fruity or fresh scents for the gym.
like the Hulk, so I'm gonna get that again. Okay. With um, chocolate. chocolate. Yep. 32 ounces again. Um, I'm gonna get the 20 ounce again. <laughs> Yeah, it does taste good. <laughs> I can't have too much of it though. So I'm just gonna start getting it after my workout. I'm back home. I can finally take this. Whew. That feels 10 times better. Oh my God. I'm basically just gonna chill for the rest of the day. I have a day off today, which is very rare for me, but I'm really enjoying filming and trying to find my groove back. My little social anxiety was bubbling. In public in general, I just, we don't mesh. But I'm trying my best for you guys. I recently just moved so there's been a lot of adjusting. I've been neglecting myself and self-care. I finally got my pedicure, which I haven't gotten a pedicure since my birthday. And if you guys know me, I'm a Leo. My birthday was August 2nd. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> finally getting back in the swing of things, getting back into a healthy routine. And I'm glad I had a day off today so I could finally just zen, do some me time. But this is my dad's birthday weekend, so I'm going to go hang out with him. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying this new style of editing, video, vlog, a new side of me, a uh, bare face to me. Um, I'm definitely going to do my makeup at some point because, girl, we can't be looking like this forever, okay? I need to get glam at some point. So I'm still a glam hoe, just not all the time. And today was one of those times where you saw, this is real, this is me, I'm exactly where I'm supposed to be. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.